heightened concern over mail during this election season, this story may hit a nerve. Mail-in ballots that were, until today, just sitting in trash, along with a wedding announcement, a last will and testament, and other important documents. Channel 2 investigator Robert Arnold is solving the mystery tonight by tracking down how that mail got into that dumpster. Robert? Well, that's the $64,000 question U.S. postal inspectors are working on now. We do know the mail was not stolen here. It was tossed in that dumpster. As for who did it, one big clue was captured by complex security cameras. It's 3.29 a.m. and you're watching two men, faces covered, dumping two large boxes of mail in a dumpster at the Willow Run townhomes on Perry Road near Winfern. Later in the morning, a resident noticed the dump mail and alerted complex yeah. management. I was wondering, what is this? You know, who, who, where did it come from? Who did this? John Lester got everything out of the dumpster and into the complex's office while they waited for postal inspectors. All of it was opened and dumped. Here's a rundown of what was tossed in the trash. This here was last will and testament for a child. When we seen it was a, a bunch of personal information. There's a bunch of legal documents in there. Voter ballots, there's uh, wedding announcements. You heard that last part right. We saw one absentee ballot, a vote for President Donald Trump bound for Baton Rouge. Another was heading to California. It's very concerning. When a postal employee arrived to collect the mail. This is raw mail. This is raw mail. Raw mail means it hadn't been processed yet. See, no postmarks. None of this mail was stolen here. The Postal Service reports at least some of the mail was stolen from the drop-off boxes at the post office on West 19th, a good 12 miles away. That may not be the only place that was hit, though. This was just sent yesterday. An employee of the Guest Law Firm told us these documents were left at the post office on Timmins near Lakewood Church. That's what's so shocking. That, that where the post office is located and it's found way over here. And that brings us back to this video. You can't see a license plate, but here's a better look at the car. And the two men are clearly dumping the mail. U.S. Postal Inspectors are leading this investigation, including making sure those two ballots reach proper destinations. We're going to have information on how to check if your mail was among this mail that was stolen and dumped in the dumpster, along with another look at that surveillance video on the homepage of click2houston.com. Reporting live from Northwest Harris County, Robert Arnold, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Yep, it strikes a nerve, Robert.